While school is out for the summer, in DeSoto County, many are already looking to the future. Every summer we look at our facilities and we look at possible upgrades that we can make. Security is top of mind for district leaders as they head into the next school year. Thursday morning, the school board voted to approve $2 million in funding for school resource officers. Back in 2017, the district says they only had 15 school resource officers. Since then, that number has increased to 30. DeSoto County School Superintendent Corey Uselton says the additional funding would allow them to have an officer at all 39 campuses. We want to make sure that we do everything we can, that our students are protected, our teachers are protected, and that our parents know that we're making every effort to make sure that we have uh, measures in place. These changes come nearly a month after 19 children and two teachers were killed during a shooting at a Texas school. Uselson says tragedies like those reaffirm his belief about the importance of having law enforcement at schools. That's intensified those uh, discussions. It really, uh, really makes it uh, even more necessary to, to have that type of protection. It's something we've been striving for for a long time. The district says the funding will be dispersed across different municipalities and law enforcement agencies across DCS, and then each school will tweak their security based on its needs. There will be some upgrades that are made in certain areas uh, to where principals feel like uh, the campus will be more secure uh, if we do certain things for that campus. Reporting in DeSoto County, Jordan James, WREG, News Channel 3.